Hey guys, welcome to the British summer in my like furry gilet and hat and dog. Uh, yeah, you know, it's just like, what, the second week of June? <laughs> Why would it be sunny? Right, okay, let me just pop this in the comments because this just felt relevant. I was driving along, and as I'm driving, I was asking myself, like, I feel really... Hmm. I felt at odds with how I am feeling today. That's probably the best way to put it. And I started asking myself, like, oh, okay, hey, Laura, morning. I started asking myself, okay, so I feel low energy and I feel a bit like, hmm, and just kind of, like, kind of peaceful, if I'm honest. But then I started making that wrong. I started making the, like, the low energy state feel like, oh, I should feel more high vibe and, you know, the things that I want to do and that I want to kind of achieve today or whatever. I need to be like super high vibe to to make all of that happen. And then I was like, okay, so if that's the case, how do I shift out of this feeling? So I'm driving to take the hat off because it's ridiculous. I have to wear a hat at this time of year. My hair's still wet from the shower. I was not planning to go live at all right now. I am holding my phone, balanced on my steering wheel. So my shoulders and my forearms are getting a great workout right now. <laughs> um, and this is just going to be a quickie. But when I was driving along just now, I was kind of thinking, right, okay, so do I want to feel like this for the rest of the day? No. Okay, so how do I shift out of it? And I was thinking, oh, well, I can't, I can't be bothered to do any of the things. Like, I don't have the energy to do any of the things that feel like it would shift me out. Because if I'm honest, PMT, probably due on today. So I've got that kind of, like, that drained feeling that I get on that day. Heinzy, sweetheart, don't worry. My poor dog is bursting for a poo, but I just had to jump on and do a live stream. <laughs> poor Heinz suffers. I know, sweetheart. Um, and the message that came through and that I felt called to share because I feel like there's more to share and the way that it's gonna that I'm gonna open the channel for that to happen is by speaking so I thought I'd share it with you guys why not right um so the message that was coming through very strongly and made my whole body just like go you're so bloody cute and that made my whole body just like decompress and relax the message was stop making how you're feeling wrong stop making it mean something stop making it something that you have to shift out of or change out of or change yourself maybe be open to the possibility that you can be and receive and do and feel and have all the things that you want today regardless of the fact that you're feeling a bit low energy and maybe it's okay to feel this way and maybe you don't it's the needing to shift out of it or the making it wrong needing to feel a different way or thinking I need to feel a different way that's the problem that's what was making the kind of the feeling the sensation in my body it was my head and my thoughts that were making the feeling wrong. Because actually, much like I talk about um, excitement, fear, anxiety being very similar vibrations and sensations in the body, the same is true with calm, peacefulness, contentment, and this kind of perceived low energy, um, tired, fatigue, blah, kind of feeling. It's actually just, if you were to examine how it feels in the body, there are a lot of similarities between those things. And it's our brain and our perception, our meaning of them. And we translate them and make them something good or bad. And so the message that was coming through was just very strongly, stop making how you're feeling wrong. Stop making it not okay to feel how you feel. And actually... <laughs> bizarrely or maybe not bizarrely kind of obviously really when you think about it by accepting it not and I don't mean accepting like resigning yourself to oh well this is how I feel again there's an energy attached to that so in just saying well, maybe it's just okay to feel this way what happens in and of itself I know Laura Paul Hines I will take him for a poo like two minutes 
God love him. He's such a good boy. Aren't you, babes? <laughs> um, my little mate. My yeah, little sweetheart. Mm -hmm. I talk to him, it makes it worse. It's like I'm a poo whisperer. If I talk to him, it's like he can feel it. <laughs> uh oh. Might be another dog somewhere. Anyway, the longer I get distracted, the more distracted I am, the longer it takes for him to get a poo. So I will finish this very quickly and just say, stop making how you're feeling wrong. Know that if it's something that's uncomfortable to you, it might be that your resistance of it and your not accepting that you're allowed to feel that way or that those feelings are just part of the human experience and part of who you are today by just allowing them leaning into them allowing them to flow through you and not judging yourself or the feeling in and of itself don't judge the feeling and don't judge yourself for feeling that way then maybe just maybe hashtag slash definitely um you will feel better and the feeling will shift and your energy will change and you'll be in more acceptance of who you are in general and not just how you're feeling. Is that making sense? So even if you're feeling a way that you think you shouldn't be or that you don't want to be feeling, just take a breath and allow and forgive yourself and accept that, okay, this is just where I am in this moment. But it doesn't have to define your whole day. It can be just a part of your day. It can be something that just flows through you and can change in an instant. And very often the thing that helps you change it is just being in acceptance, allowing and just, it takes as long as it takes. Okay. I'm not going to try to force and change anything. I'm just going to allow myself to be in this energy and then do go about my day and just do my things that I know I have to do, like walk the dog, eat some lunch, make sure I stay hydrated and do the things that I know I need to do for myself, journaling, etc., etc. And then before I know it, what will happen, because I do this all the time, what will happen is you just shift the energy. The energy just changes. So just remember that for today because I felt like I needed to share the message. I didn't feel like it was just for me today. I felt like it was for maybe more of a collective unconscious of the people who follow my work anyway. So if you've caught this live, whether it's on the live stream or whether it's catching the replay, let me know if that resonates for you. But just remember that however you're feeling, it's okay. It's only your perception and your thoughts and your judgment on the feeling and on yourself for having the feeling that's what makes it good or bad and so maybe you get to just shift your perspective and say okay that's cool I can change it if I want to it will change if I set the intention I'd like to feel shifted from this way of feeling and then just let it go it'll come it'll happen and it'll happen when it needs to happen and always know that the way that you are feeling in any given moment is necessary for you to feel however you're going to feel later on so the way that I'm feeling now is allowing something to happen for me which means that later on in the day something else gets to happen so rather than again rather than judging it thinking I need to feel a certain way in order for xyz things to happen in my life Maybe, just maybe the universe and my body know better and they're saying, hey kiddo, this is where you need to be right now and when your energy shifts, you will feel it. When your energy shifts, you'll be aware of it. You'll be able to help people shift their energy in the future because you've learned to understand yourself on a deeper level. And also, maybe I need to feel this way so that I can come on and do a live stream and share this message and help someone else. Maybe that's what it was about. Who knows? doesn't matter. It's done. It's over. I already feel better. See you later. Bye.